okay so it says that the partial pressure of the gas in the vapor phase that pressure being named p is directly proportional to the mole fraction which we call x of the gas in the solution form and we write it as p is directly proportional to x this is vapor this is solution okay now obviously we have been seeing that the proportionality sign goes away and it becomes this okay this is this okay what is kh this is called this is called call henry what does it say henry law constant henry's constant whatever it's a constant it's a constant okay law constant <coughs> okay now let us try to understand now now what happens is this i have if i have the mole fraction plotted like this and the pressure p plotted like this okay so so is it not is it not an equation so so this is my y and this is my x somehow mole fraction is also x and so so this is what this is the equation of a line that passes through the origin is it not it passes through the origin okay it passes through the origin so so let us try to draw let us try to draw this line fine so 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 this line will be something like this correct this line will be something like this and since we understand calculus we know straight lines what does it tell you can you find the dy by dx of it hmm what is the dy of upon dx of this hmm differentiating both sides y is equal to kh into x so what is the dy upon dx that is equal to kh is it not this is kh that means the slope of this line is the henry law constant is it not that means you just measure this theta and just take tan of it you get kh we understand therefore kh is nothing but tan theta correct and it is a constant it should be for a line the slope is constant at every point it is fine that corroborates what we already know no that supports what we know fine <coughs> now what if the, there's a there's a this is say kh1 okay and there is another another gas obviously the gases they'll have different khs right so let us say there is another gas and and it is something like this and i call this k h k h2 the red line okay now can you tell me between kh1 and kh2 
which gas is more soluble at the same temperature, same pressure. See, at the at the same pressure, at the same pressure, the mole fraction of gas one is this much, while the mole fraction of gas two is only this. Do we see that? Which has dissolved more at the same pressure? KH one. Mole this fraction mole fraction in solution. So, it that is what? We have flipped the whole thing. It is the source of major co confusion. Fine. And we have not written it anywhere in the, in the book. We should have pointed it out while writing the book. This should have been pointed out that we are now flipping our logic on the head. That is why I wrote solution here and vapor here correct so this is in the solution phase this is in the vapor phase never lose sight of that so as your as your henry the value of your of your henry law constant goes up the solubility of that particular gas with everything else remaining the same goes down correct so, as KH increases, the solubility of the gas at the same pressure and temperature goes down. Yes, you were asking something? <coughs> KH is equal to? Huh. KH is equal to P upon X. So, so if, if at the same pressure your KH is high, that means obviously your X is less, then only KH goes high. Somehow it is kind of a, a, of a of a uh, of a figure of demerit you understand it's a figure of demerit in what what sense that lower the cage higher is the solubility higher the cage lower is the solubility right and vice versa so what happens if KH goes down, the solubility of the gas goes up. As KH reduces the solubility of the gas at the same pressure and temperature goes up. Fine. Goes up. Okay. Now, if the solubility is supposed to be increasing with the temperature, it means the value of KH will start reducing with the temperature. It means that, that and, and since the slope is the value of KH, so its slope starts going like that. So, for the same gas, if I increase the temperature, it goes like that. You understand? No, sorry, 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 extremely sorry. What happens with temperature? If you start increasing the temperature, what do you feel will, will start happening? Solubility will go up or down? Mm -hmm. Solubility of the gas in the solution will go up or down? Down. I am increasing the temperature. Hmm. 
So what will happen? If it goes down, then KH starts going up with temperature. Less solubility, KH is higher. So at higher temperature, it will be start becoming like that. If you are if you are uh, having coke, what happens? Hmm? And you sort of heat it. What's going to happen? Hmm. That's because uh, it is ejected, right? So the, the the gases get ejected. Fine. 